Hey you all, how you going? Hey, great to see you back with video number two. Look, I was very amazed and overwhelmed with the feedback, positive feedback from uh, the first video. I really appreciate it. I didn't know what to expect. What I found, there was a, a common theme in all the comments I got and the emails I uh, received, and that was they love the authentic, real and rawness of it, which I thought, fantastic, that's great. And it sets me up for a um, hot tip for today's video. As you know, in my videos, in three minutes, I'm going to give you some red hot, short, sharp and punchy marketing tips. It's going to help you grow, expand and um, explode your business to all new heights. Okay. I have to quickly mention there was um, a lot of great comments about my new video editing in, in real time technology that I kind of displayed. Um, and look, I appreciate that. I'm pretty proud of it. I'm thinking about turning it into some kind of a um, home study course. Um, but I have to ex um, share some more exciting news. I've actually taken it to a whole new level. That's right. I've got the whole thing outsourced. Outsourced is a hot topic right now, and I've got the whole thing outsourced. Why have I done that? Because it gives me more time. Okay, more time so I can spend uh, on my business, um, with my family, having fun, all those. Because it's a very smarter way to do things. I'm pretty sure you spelt smarter wrong. Nope. It, it, it actually is in the uh, um, English is not really your first first language, is it? Nope. Okay. <laughs> that actually means disappear. So yeah, look, there's pros and cons about sourcing. It's hard to find uh, the right bit of trial and error. But anyway, we're moving forward. So let's go to the the red hot tip today, which is how to be your authentic self and capture the realness. Um, because the most valuable commodity in your marketing today is trust okay trust people don't buy from you if they don't believe you people don't believe you unless they trust you okay so how are you going to capture that? here's what I do if you, if you you're marketing yourself or if you're working with clients and you're doing the marketing for them um, I've got to catch when I do it I, I when I work with a client I interview them on Skype usually record the uh, the interview and I capture their voice and get it transcribed and that's the real authentic um, a core element of their voice and their language and their conversational tone. That's what people love. People, most people, feel compelled to use, you know, big words and, and try and um, try and sound extremely educated and they're they're more in, institutionalized, right? Here's the thing: the comprehension rate of, of um, the adults in uh, for reading is equivalent to a grade eight student or a thirteen year old. Okay, so I try to dumb it down. Everyone thinks, "Wow, Brady, you're such an amazing writer, you mate." You know, million dollar campaigns but if you read that what I do it's very simple language because if if they stumble and they trip up on big words and long sentences then they're going to start skim reading and it breaks the flow I keep my sentences um, trying about seven words long believe it or not not including AI in and it's and all the small words but short sharp and punchy with small words so it's easy to digest and they read more the more they read the more they buy I never forget that Okay, so look, that's a, a real big tip. I think you can take that away. Um, if not yourself, you know, if, if you're marketing yourself, capture your own voice, make it a conversational style, be authentic, do videos or whatever, but be real and capture that authentic self. And if it's for your clients, interview them and capture that language and uh, and, and real dumb it down because you're going to get more, more people to read your marketing. Okay, that's it. I'll be signing off. You want more? Um, uh, great content and ideas and tips from me then go to brettthompson.com and, and join the the growing community on my email subscribers list or subscribe to this channel also which a lot of people did after my first video so I appreciate that also do you know you can share videos do you know that you can actually share you should try that if you have never shared a video make this your first give it a go it's kind of fun you'll see what happens anyway that's it for, for me I'm going to get my outsourcer to stop this video catch you later on That's not the right button, dude.